everyone. Welcome to Positive Power with Michelle Dion. I hope you're enjoying this beautiful weather. Summer isn't actually official for a couple weeks, but the heat has come on fast and furious. It is hot here in southwestern Ontario, but absolutely beautiful. We've had some rain. That's okay. It is spring after all. And our tomato plants are going to appreciate that. I don't know about you as far as gardening, but I'm pleased to say I've got some tomatoes um, growing. What else did we do? We did onions, peppers. Um, a friend of mine gave us a lemon tree, so we have a little lemon tree growing. Super excited about that. And growing your own food is a wonderful way to take control of your own consumption, which is so important, especially these days, with all the chemicals that are in the, f that are in the food. And I share a lot of that stuff on my Facebook, um, on my own page and on my Positive Power page, because that is something we have so much control of. You know, we are so powerful <clears throat> as consumers, and it's so important that you treat yourself like, like a temple, like the awesome thing that you are, you know? And I find it so funny, you know, you see people with their cars. I have a car. I try not to let the gas uh, get any lower than a quarter of a tank if I can. Um, I change the oil, not as often as I should, but I do. I change the oil regularly. I drop it off and somebody, you know, um, does all the stuff for me and, and does a tune-up and makes sure my fluids are full and all that stuff. So do you treat your body as good as you treat your car? It's an interesting question, isn't it? Because you should, and you need to read the labels. You know, it, it's a pain in the butt. I know it. I absolutely know it. And it's a, it seems like a lot to learn. And I really don't know a lot of the big words and everything, but I know some key things that I look for. One of which is trans fats, um, because that's really bad for you. And anything with a lot of ingredients is not good for you. And if you're careful what you consume, whether it be shopping local or going organic, which, you know, the more organic you go, the higher the price seems to, seems to be. But you can find middle ground there. So find yourself a place that you can afford that's halfway between highly processed and absolutely organic, where it's going to cost you an astronomical amount for a small, uh, small portion, because that's really impor important. A great example of this debate is butter versus margarine, and I'm going to post an article on my Positive Power page. You know, um, I have an accounting background, so I love doing like costing and <clears throat> comparing different things like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I went to the grocery store. We've only ate butter for a couple years now. So I went to the grocery store and I costed it out. A pound of butter, three ninety-seven. A pound of margarine, two ninety-seven. So then I thought, well, I wonder how many teaspoons you get in a pound. So I look online, 96. That means for every teaspoon of butter that you have, which is better for you because there's no trans fat in it, and the fat it does have is good fat, not bad fat, which this isn't a science video. We're not going to get into all that today, but it's in the article. Um, one penny difference. So when you think about that, so... You know, we talk about our preconceived mo um, thoughts and, and ideas. So somebody's put it in our head that it's too expensive to eat well, but that's not really true at all. And at the end of the day, you're worth it. You are worth feeling good. And when you look at the long-term effects of like trans fats, for example, in this article, it's right in there. Um, that they're highly toxic and strongly associated with heart disease. Well, let's look at the long term. You know, do you want quality of life or quantity of life? So do your own research. That's a great way to take control. Do your own research and know what you're consuming. We are natural people. We should be consuming natural things, not chemicals. So read your labels, take control. Of course, support your farmer's market. And I'm also pleased to say that... Um, as you know, every uh, Tuesday and Thursday, I'm on the Playfair Music Audio Stream um, at 11 a.m., which is online radio. And starting uh, on the, every Sunday, we're going to be doing Positive Power Sundays. So make sure you tune in for that, and then you can hear me live. We play some music. 
talk about good news, talk about stuff like we talk about on here, and I'd love for you to join me. So have a great week and look after yourself. You are worth every penny.